Yo YouTube, what is going on? It's your boy Creative back with an NBA Live 18 video. This is going to be a simple video if you don't know how already to do basically a perfect face scan for your player in NBA Live 18. So what you're going to do is search NBA Live 18 on the App Store and download the NBA Live Companion app. Now once you install the app, I had a little bit of problems trying to scan my face. And I don't know if this is just my skin complexion or the, you know the, the tone of my skin color. Or what it is, but I, you know, I was just having difficulty. So I was like, you know what? After I finally got it done, I'm gonna make a video so that way people don't have to fr be frustrated with it, you know, like I did. And I'm basically embarrassing myself because let's be honest, this is a non-flattering angle. So you, when you're putting your face in the circle, don't make the mistake of not putting your face too close, like I'm doing. Like you can see, you can still see my hair in the camera and stuff like that. When it catches your hair and stuff in the camera, sometimes it, it can grab onto your hair. And then not want like let you turn your face or the dot won't go with your face right or left so you have to make sure to put your face extremely close that white line that goes around your face should be literally touching your jawline if not a little inside it should literally be exactly going along with your jawline and your cheeks so you can see i finally get it to work here because i put it a little closer put it a little closer to my face and now it's going to generate the preview of my face scan. And if you're wondering how good, like, if, if mine was a fail or whatever, well, I kept getting this render error. So, if you happen to get that render error, guess what? I have a, I have a fix for you. So, I'm fixing every possible error right now you could, or problem you could pro possibly have with this face scan. If you get that render error, you're, you're going to need to do what I did. You can see the chair in the background. My skin is pretty white. So, I decided to put my face next to a bat, a dark background so that way it could really key out my face because my white i think my white face was blending in with the background of my walls or whatever you can see that's kind of unflattering right there because it caught some of my hair so i didn't think it was gonna you know do my face right i thought it was gonna end up looking like you know one of those aliens from the 2k 17 face scans we all know how bad those were but believe it or not guys this face scan is actually fairly good as you can see it's not gonna look amazing because the character is gonna be bald but that is my face scan and from telling you and this is from personal experience for me looking at my face every single day for my entire life that is so accurate of my facial features it is uncanny it is unreal how close and accurate that is but that's basically all you need to do to get a perfect face scan of your face and then add your hair in the demo or whatever but here's a little comparison it might not seem like it right away, but my facial features are so on point and I can attest to this. You know, I'm just used to the way my face is. And there's my my player after I add hair and stuff. So, yeah, it's that simple. You guys enjoy. I'll see you guys later. Peace.